any anywhere. We're, we're getting the, we're getting the ingots into the assemblers, so they can't manufacture. Yeah. Correct. Right. I'm disconnecting just... right now. Uh, there go. Re reconnect for us. Yeah, because we need stuff out of the ship. Yeah, let me just have a look. See what's going on here. Exit, yep. So, Should maybe I come down to where the ship is. We've got in the ash cargo container. Got ingots. I can I can manually move the ingots into the assemblers. Yeah, but it's still not doing anything. Even when the the uh, ingots are in the assembler. I was gonna say, Torin, you, you should put the sensor on the on your hotbar so we can switch it on and off. Assembler five's not told to build anything, so it's not gonna pull anything through. They they should have put the assembler six, five, and assembler five. Yeah, I've just told assembler five to build a bunch of motors. Yeah, well the thing is, that they have a five slave to uh, five. Two and one and a regular assembler. I have slave to the uh, six, so it should be everything should be running off of that that one. Mm. And well, if it's... I doing that, oh wait, wait. It looked like it was. It looked like it was making something there. No, oh, it wasn't. Uh, no. Assembler five. I just told assembler five to make me a hundred motors. But you're right. That's not pulling ours in, is it? No. Hmm. That's why. Uh, that's why. Just use. Uh, just. Nation I'll just do it manually. It. Give me five seconds. I'll just do it manually. It's not pulling anything because I put. I just made a one. I know I what's wrong. I, I. I know what's wrong. Hey. What's what? up? What? The assemblers aren't switched on. <laughs> 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 That's brilliant, man. That's absolutely brilliant. <laughs> you are so smart. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh. <laughs> if I go to production now, assembler 5, until that's make 100 motors. No, do, go to assembler 6, because 5, all of them are slave to, uh, all of them are slave to 6. Right, so they're all slaves to number six. So, hold on, give me a second. I'm gonna... Let me finish reorganizing again before uh, we start again. Because I wanted to actually pull everything from the connector. Well, it did pull things through when I told it to build the motors, so that's working. Yeah, but the thing is, I'm trying I'm to move everything into the connector so that... um, I'm trying to move everything to the connector. So that uh, it doesn't, you know, just fill up one assembler. Yeah. So give me one second to figure this out. Where the zero uh, six has too many things. So don't start anything yet. Well, I need the motors. So... Yeah, but I've been. I'm trying to sort it so that it would. There we go. Okay, it should be working fine now. Uh. So six five. Yep, you have like thirty. Construction component. Or hmm. and I'm out of motors now. So Uh, we need nickel. No, we have nickel. What are we missing? Cobalt. Yeah, we need more cobalt.
for love. Yeah. Um. Okay, looks like I'm going back in again. Was that cobalt? Mm-hmm. Cobalt. Okay. Conveyor is connected. Okay. The conveyor is connected. Right. Okay, oh, okay. The cobalt. That's what it is, okay. Um, get behind. Oh, I can't reach that back there. Let's wait until this door is open. Yay, meet your storm. Heading down the cobalt. Cobalt is in the assemblers. just crashed then. What? You just crashed into the connector then. How? I had Ooh! You were so lucky, Tora. I'm How? not even joking. An asteroid just crashed right past you. It like, oh. seriously, look, it just hit the spot here, right here. I mean, it just come right down. I was like, luck and gone. Oh. So it stopped just in time or something? No, you just, you know, you moved out of the way. Oh, there's another one. Oh, it's just a bit of rock. Um, it just comes crashing straight down past you as you would sort of flew past. I was like, if that was, see, if that had a hit, that would have been the end of Welder. Dangerous places. Okay, what we got here? Need a ton more construction components. You need construction components? Yeah. How many? Shouts uh, here, shouldn't there? Uh, production. Mm 
There we go, I'll get them going. Should start building some of those modules, Torn, maybe. Sorry, I'm trying to move everything I need for uh, continuing to build stuff. I'll need 120 to finish this conveyor, and then the rest of the conveyor system up there. Which which one's the best for the assemblers? Should we go for productivity or effectiveness or well, it's power efficiency? It's productivity, isn't it, or effectiveness? Uh, productivity, productivity is, um, speed. Effectiveness is, uh, only done for the refinery. Mm-hmm. And we're missing so. a, uh, one of the conveyor to got disconnected from, uh, whatever you're trying to do here. Yeah, I need to build that conveyor before we build that con. Come in and be at, on the edge of your... Okay. But yeah, the conveyor in the middle um, needs building. Yeah, I can't reach. You know that conveyor behind this conveyor block I'm seeing in front of? I can't reach it. Where am I looking? Oh, we're gonna have to do it manually. So this one needs motors and bulletproof glass. I don't have any bulletproof glass. But this conveyor right here is sorted. Construction components, construction components. Construction components, okay. Yeah, just tons and tons of construction components. It's all 500 to build. Oh, okay, that's all we need then. Well, and 500 glass. construction components. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. I'm just jumping in the welder for a sec. I just need to recharge. Okay. And we've got 20 minutes left, guys, before we're going to have to call this quits. Okay. Sure. Because then we've got, like, like tons of footage. <laughs> And uh, I don't think any of you want to sit through all the footage I've got to review just to uh, get this sorted, do we? Yeah, uh, yeah uh, 23, 43 more construction components for that conveyor, and then I can relock that one in. Okay, what do I need? Oh. Yeah, batteries would be nice. You know what? I am going to disassemble some more. Seven more construction components. That one's back in place. Oh, 
lost your tubes as well. A door. I got the tubes, so uh, just need construction components. Oh, no. yeah. If you guys no, want, don't put that one there because we need to put a control panel in here to. Actually, we'll only have the one control panel in this airlock. Yeah, leave that there. Make it nice and pretty. If you want, I could just um, if you could just wait. I'll put I'll finish off the uh, tubes with the construction components. And then, uh, yeah, that means the main ship's going to be hooked up to that ship. Yeah. Torin, can you go, can you give these a quick run? These um, uh, modules. Which modules? Over oh. here. Sure, but uh, okay. are the Gatling guns actually armed? Only one of them is, and the other one, I have no idea. I'm just going to go check on it now. Either way, I can't get into the connector to get the stuff out without going into the ship. Oh. Nope, both Catlin turrets are now empty. Uh oh. So, uh, get brace yourself, guys. Oh no. Getting into the ship as fast as I can. I'm actually tempted to say oxygen would be damned, but. Where yeah. is it? Mark your mark. It's gonna be at least like 10 seconds, 20 seconds. So by the time I get back out there with ammo. Um. We've only got one ammo container in here as well. <laughs> oh, the ship's been hit. Ship's been hit. Oh, no way. Badly. Oh. oh, right near the cryopods. And the wall ship got hits. Okay, um... Looks like we're... Oh, wow. Looks like we're in repair detail. Oh, wow. Yeah, it got hit really, really bad. Torn. Yeah, look at the word. It, it hit exactly on the large container. Really? That was some. That that was a precision hit. <laughs> right. Well, I brought out the one cargo container. I mean, seriously, <laughs> it hit the large cargo container. Oh, we've um, lost some solar panels. It left. Oh, oh wow. Took it, out one it, of the solar panels. It left everything else. Took out some of the engines. Did the damage. Yeah, from now on, priority must be ammunition. I nearly took out the refinery down there. We are losing air. Eddie says we are losing air. Okay. I, I was just in there, I'm sure we would add pressure. Hey, there's a big hole in the side, I'm gonna go and patch it up now. Fair enough. Hey, if Torn could come over actually with the welder. Uh, I just told you, the welder got hit. What? Oh, no way. This cannot be armor. Oh, yeah, okay. Let's see. Oh, wow. Yeah, I actually didn't swing round that side of the ship. You only saw the front? There we go. Them, them two done. 
Six. This should give us pressure. Uh, on top of the refinery, there's a hole actually. Hey, just need enough handful of plates to get those sealed. Oh, is there? Oh, yeah. yeah that's right. I, I dropped some up there. Yeah, I can see it from inside. Don't worry about that side one. Just get the one refinery one capped. I've got the side inside. There we go. Is it got pressure? No, nah, just that refinery one left. Be built. Okay, come on, extra plates. There we go. No, still no pressure. Hang on a sec, hang on a sec, hang on a sec. There we go, got pressure. We have oxygen again. Well, an oxygenated ship, anyhow. Right, that's one problem, sort of. Um, so, what about the welder? What's it like? Oh my. Has the welder literally been taken out of commission now? Until we rebuild the uh, building, yeah. Wow. Well, at least now we've got a challenge for next episode. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I want to get this thing at least stable on its own power. Yeah, that's fair enough. That way it doesn't float off on us. Oh. I swear, those meteors have amazing accuracy. <laughs> no, so the, ox the oxygen tank in the airlock's actually nearly full. Um, because obviously that one has to... Uh, that one fills up quite quickly. Mm -hmm. uh, we're sitting at about 120% oxygen though. Out of 200%. No ice. Ah. Uh. Get out of the way, please. Uh, you know what? Uh huh. This, this is gonna be too hard. Let's just grind it out. Are we grinding down the ship? We're Whoa. grinding down. We're grinding down the uh. The the welder ship. It's too difficult without having any anchor. Yeah. Try and save as many components as possible. We could just build. We could just build out of the uh, thing that's still attached to the the uh, station. I look down, I look down, and there's a spotlight. What's up, Eddie? <laughs> Where is Eddie? Are you just going to build off the back of that again? Yep. Has anyone seen Eddie? Eddie? Yeah, he just said help. Okay, something's not right here. Right, so Where you've got the... He's back in the ship. I think we might have killed him. Uh-oh. Oh, yes. That body I see floating next to Steve. No, that's Steve. Oh, there's a body, is it? Oh, there's parts out here. Yeah, I need to, we need to grab it. Grab them. It's a gyro. Uh, mm, we might have to start over on the welding ship completely. Okay. Um, we need somewhere to. S I need somewhere to store this stuff. I just dumped it all back into the assembler. 
Does somebody want to come out here and they might not have room to get all this That's stuff? Probably a good idea. Um, just putting in the assembler for now. Okay, still iron plates and construction components on this corpse here. Where am I looking? Uh, towards me. Or Eddie, if Eddie Eddie, wants to come I this. can see Eddie. Please, Steve, I can't see you. Oh, there you are. I found you on my way over. Nudge not towards you. Yeah, don't, don't nudge yet. It's just some plates and stuff on it. Yeah, let's stick everything into assemblers. I have robbed the corpse. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take his money. Oh, Eddie. We're going to have to get your microphone working, buddy. Yeah. He's a little shy, but he is a great hoot, I can assure you. Okay, where's the... Okay, we can grind down the connectors and get this. So you've ground down that connector there. Going to. Whoa, jeez. I'm full. Not grind, hang on. One. Oh, I'll have that piece. I'll have that. Okay, I'm gonna jump on the prow. Take that away. Hey, I filled up. Ew, whoa. Okay. You hoover up all the pieces. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, some large steel tube in there. Oh, you sound really, really distraught, mate. Inventory full. Just like. I built that at the beginning of this episode, and by the end, I'm having to. Think. <laughs> yeah. You might Seriously, well... <laughs> that poor ship lasted less than two hours. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. So yeah. Well, if you if you have a look where the um between the, this conveyor and. Where the friggin' door is and everything, that's where the uh That's where the landing bay is gonna be, so you can start building there soon. Once we've got okay. some uh, ammo. Well, I'm gonna build the welding ship near the assemblers because that's where all the uh, components are for the ship. For the welding ship. Yeah. Oh the arc furnace doesn't work on scrap metal unless it's switched off. Arc furnace, yeah, they're switched off. There we go. So, it's time for everyone to go to bed, I think. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And uh, we're going to have to uh, come back another day. Okay. okay. So, we started, we started this episode off with two ships, and now we're down to one. <laughs> Okay, I'm deprice raising the uh, airlock. Anybody wants in? Yeah, we should all be heading in now. I'm gonna want everybody's in. Just waiting on Steve. I'm in. You're in? Mm -hmm. Are you? Can't see Are you? you. Yeah. Oh, seriously, we can't see you. Oh, right, he's, he's already on. Oh, you're already in the ship. Yeah. Sneaky little. <laughs> We're talking about the airlock. Oh. <laughs> right.
Here we go, Ahmed. Uh, you're not gonna grind me down again, are you? No, you're right. <laughs> I don't need... trust you. Ah! There's another one! We're all over my ship! <laughs> so, this has been another exciting episode of Space Engineers. Say goodbye, everyone. Bye. Bye. Thank you for watching, and uh, hopefully, you know, we might survive the next meteor strike. <laughs> <laughs>